Welcome to Dental Board Sunday. In previous video, we learnt about working length, working width and various ways to determine working length. Hi, I am Dr. Rohit Sharma. In this video, we are going to learn about Apex Locator, its importance, how to use it and tips for getting correct working length. Apex Locator is based on electronic principle of electrical resistance. When a circuit is complete, resistance decreases markedly and current suddenly begins to flow. First generation Apex Locator operated on direct current principle. A problem with these devices was that conductive fluids such as hemorrhage, exudates or irrigants in the canal would permit current flow and therefore gave a false reading. Newer devices are impedance based, using alternating current of two frequencies. These measure and compare two electrical impedance that change as file moves opaquely. The benefit is that these devices are much less affected by fluid conductive media in the canal. Here question arises what apex locator measures. It measures canal terminus. It distinguishes between major and minor foramen. It can locate lateral canal which later can be confirmed by x-ray. It can even tell you about perforations. This advantage of apex locator is that it can give incorrect readings which may lead to over instrumentation and sometimes useless in radiolucencies or open apex. Now, let's discuss some tips for using apex locator. Do not use single frequency apex locator. Use only dual or multiple frequency. Apex locator is contraindicated in patient with cardiac pacemakers. Lip and file clip should be clean and sterilized. Lip clip should touch a moist lip. Isolation is necessary. Saliva, blood or hypochlorite should not seep into the chamber. Use extra barrier with rubber dam if necessary. Pre-endodontic filling is highly recommended to avoid leakage of fluids. Try to keep chamber dry, but we can use lubricating jangle like EDTA. Presence of small quantities of blood, pulp, tissues, hypo, EDTA in the canal is clinically insignificant. Instrument should not be loose in the canal. It should bind well to the canal walls in the apical area. It is recommended to achieve first coronal flare so that the file binds apically. Use one size larger file if you do not get reading with thin files. Use EDTA gel as insulator. While using K file, dip the instrument in EDTA gel every time. Metal peelings or metal crowns should not come in contact with K-file. Rubber or plastic sleeve can be put onto the file to avoid contact with metal. Sudden change in graph is due to leakage of current which suggests wrong working length or perforation or wide apical foramen or accessory canals. Gradual increase in graph shows correct reading. Withdraw the file by 1 to 2 mm and repeat the procedure to confirm the length while withdrawing graph should change gradually in case of wide apical foramen apex locator may not show accurate measurement in deciduous teeth use of apex locator is not recommended the reading in millimeter do not indicate precise proximity to the apex it just shows that one is close to the apex if you do not get proper reading on the screen at the particular length, pre-curving the instrument or following the crown down technique would help you try the procedure with dry canal. Always reconfirm the working length after complete cleaning and shaping. Although Apex Locator is a reliable instrument, it has some limitations due to anatomical variation. One has to confirm the reading by a radiograph. It definitely reduces the chance of over instrumentation and the need to take multiple radiographs. Thus, it is highly recommended to use Apex Locator in every root canal case before we start the final cleaning and shaping. Apex Locator is always used in conjunction with radiograph. Apex Locator does not completely replace the usage of radiographic film. Check batteries regularly, more than 50% of the battery is recommended before use. If you cannot find proper measurement on Apex Locator, do not blame the machine, it is just a matter of understanding the machine by practice. 
Thank you for watching. Please subscribe our channel to watch our other useful videos.